Good morning yes. again, Jay. How are Good you morning. doing? Good morning. Hi there. Yeah, many gods better than one. Now, Hinduism is an incredibly interesting religion. Indeed. I've been read about it a lot over the last Indeed. week or so. Indeed. Very complex, very flexible, and very many people believe many different things. Indeed. You see, so, some, some of you believe in many gods and goddesses. Indeed. You see, Hinduism is sometimes misunderstood to be mm. a polytheist religion. Believe, mm. means believing, believing in lots of ultimate realities. This is a contradiction in terms. You can't do more than one ultimate, because it's not ultimate enough. Hinduism has never been a polytheist tradition. It has always been a very mature, pluralistic tradition. Not many gods, but many ways to relate to the idea of spirituality. It can incorporate monotheism, means accepting one supreme personality. It can incorporate non-theistic approaches as well as non-religious approaches for making spiritual progress. This is called spiritual democracy. And the lovely word is religious pluralism, many pathways for exploring spirituality. So it's to say, the, the, there is one ultimate supreme being? Not being. We say it's a principle that underpins right. this reality which is essentially spiritual rather than material that manifests itself at different layers right. as the material level and this demarcation between, if you like, man, God and universe is very artificial. It is time we demolish is, this is this, is this the, the way out? Is this the way out for the Church of England out of their current problem? <laughs> <laughs> in, in fact, the debate... Maybe, in fact, in fact, earlier on, you yeah, think yeah, they were talking about different gods. I, I, I was listening to Jay and thinking, gosh, perhaps I'm a Hindu and I... Yeah. 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 In fact, in fact, in fact the, the word pluralism, in a way, resolves the issue of intra-faith dialogue as well. Forget yeah. about inter-faith, intra-faith dialogue. Because this is the way I relate to the idea of spirituality. This is the way you relate to so the So there idea are different of aspects to, to... Different ways of relating to the idea of the spirituality. Power, uh, ultimate power. Ultimate reality. There are different ways of seeing that supreme Indeed. power. The supreme power has many different faces and Indeed. relating to Indeed. In fact, this, Brahma, this is, Vishnu, Shiva. Whatever. And as a principle, even, not yeah. as a personality, as a principle that underpins reality called spirit. So, in a way, this, is, this gives freedom for different people, depending on their own temperament, to relate to the idea of spirituality suited to their own temperament. And some yeah. are goddesses, too. Indeed. Why, why should God, God yeah. always be a father? And, Mother and, goddess is my, my lovely idea as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>